Hi, everybody. It's summer. And something I love to do in summer is eat one of my favorite treats. And I'll give you a clue. My favorite treat is really cold. My favorite treat comes on a cone. I can put sprinkles on my favorite treat. Do you know what it is? Ice cream! I love ice cream in the hot, hot summer because ice cream is cold, cold, cold and can cool us down. So today I'm going to read a story called Gorilla Loves Vanilla. If you take a walk down Jelly Bean Street, there's a wonderful place you can go for a treat. A fabulous store full of yummy ice cream. <gasps> the kind of ice cream that makes everyone beam. Little Sam Sunday is known as the king of cones and wafers and flavors that ding. <gasps> this little boy is called Sam Sunday and he is the worker at the ice cream shop. One sunny day as Sam opened the store, five hungry animals dashed through the door. <gasps> Uh-oh, here come animals into the ice cream shop. First in line was a little mouse who squeaked, Please, may I have a sundae that tastes like blue cheese? Now that might sound scrumptious to little gray mice, but none of the others thought cheese ice cream was nice. It sounded quite stinky, P-U, but Sam didn't blink. He rushed up, he rustled up cheesy ice cream in a wink. <gasps> Ooh, do you think you like cheese ice cream? Mmm, I don't know if I would like cheese ice cream either. I think it might be stinky. Pee you. But mice love cheese, so I bet that's a perfect cool treat for a mouse, right? Next to step up was a cat, his whiskery cheeks as a white sailor's hat. My favorite meal, he said, is a sailing cat's wish. Bring me a fish finger ice cream in a dish. It sounded quite yucky, but Sam didn't blink. He rustled up fishy ice cream in a wink. Oh, the cat likes to eat fish, so he wanted fish ice cream. Would you like to try fish ice cream? Ooh, I don't know if I would like fish ice cream either. But kitty cat sure does. <gasps> Next is the <laughs> chicken, you're right. The chicken said, Mark, I'll have a cone full of worms. <gasps> Worms. I like nothing more than an ice cream that squirms. It's funny the way that it wriggles and jiggles. It tickles my beak and it gives me the giggles. It sounded too squirmy, but Sam didn't blink. He rustled up wormy ice cream in a wink. Oh, goodness. Do you think you'd like to try worm ice cream? Oh, not me. No, thank you. But chicken sure like worms. Let's see. Do you remember what kind of ice cream Mouse wanted? Stinky cheese, right? What about the cat? The cat wanted fish ice cream. And the chicken? The chicken wanted worm ice cream. The flavor the cow chose was daisies and grass. Oh, look, he wants daisies and grass. 
Daisies are a type of flower. Sprinkled with dandelions in a tall glass. Ooh, dandelions are the little yellow flowers or weeds that grow in our lawn. It's simply amusing, said the cow. She gleefully cheered, but all of her friends thought her flavor was weird. It sounded revolting, Ugh, but Sam didn't blink. He rustled up Daisy ice cream in a wink. Hmm, do you think you'd like to try Daisy and grass ice cream? With some dandelions on the top? Hmm, I don't know if I'd like that either, but it was perfect for the cow, because that's what cows eat. The hippo stomped up with a thump and a thud and asked for a cone filled with mountains of mud. I don't want to eat it, he said with a laugh. I'm going to jump in and have a nice bath. Oh my goodness. The hippo is clean or dirty? He's all dirty. You're right from all that mud. But he loves it because it's nice and cool on a hot day. It sounded quite messy, but Sam didn't blink. He rustled up muddy ice cream in a wink. Hippos love to roll around in the cool mud. Do you take mud baths? Nope, me either. I use water for my bath. I fill my bathtub with water to take a bath. The animals sang, Little Sam, you're the best. You've managed to rustle up every request. Then came a voice calling, What about mine? <gasps> a gorilla was there at the end of the line. Oh, the gorilla was last. and They almost forgot him. I don't want fish fingers or worms as a filler. Just give me a cone full of good old vanilla. The others agreed that they'd all been too hasty. None of their flavors seemed nearly as tasty. Ooh, the gorilla wants vanilla ice cream. How about vanilla? Would you like to try vanilla ice cream? <gasps> me too. That sounds delicious. <gasps> Sam served a cone that was everyone's dream. <gasps> scoop upon scoop of amazing ice cream. Wow. Look how tall that ice cream is. <gasps> so many scoops. He topped it with sprinkles and milk chocolate chips. <gasps> Ooh, that sounds yummy, sprinkles and chocolate chips. I love that on my ice cream. The sticky fudge sauce made them all <gasps> lick their lips. Mm -mm -mm. Chocolate fudge sauce is my favorite. The animals gasped. <gasps> They couldn't help staring. And lucky for them, gorillas love sharing. Oh, the gorilla is going to share his ice cream with his friends. The mouse, the cat. Hmm, can you remember what other animals are in the story? Yep, the chicken, the cow. And the, hmm, who like to roll in mud? The hippo, you're right. Gorilla has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven spoons to share with his friends. There they are, eating the yummy, huge sundae. The end. All right, friends, I hope you loved my story, Gorilla Loves Vanilla. We'll see you later. Bye-bye.